sending and receiving of emotions over long distances instantaneously. Music and emotions define a molecular structure of water crystals. The mind causes a change in water pH by one unit. The mind influences the results of a random number generator based on a quantum circuit. The mind can influence the healing response of plants over any distance. Groups of positively thinking people could significantly decrease criminal activity, car accidents, injuries, etc. When they stop this conscious intention to send positive thoughts and emotions, then the criminal activity and the rest would go back to normal. Heart has got its own bioenergetic field, reaching several feet around the body, which responds to future events approximately 6 seconds prior to them actually happening. DNA affects the formation of photons. We can change our DNA through the power of our thoughts and emotions. In the first experiment, a photon was split into two separate particles of identical properties. Then, using a special equipment, these twin photons were fired in opposite directions through a 7 miles long fiber optic cable for each photon. At the end of their destination, while being 14 miles apart, the twins were forced to choose between two random routes. No matter how many times we repeat this experiment, these two twin photons will always make the same decisions. Common sense would suggest that they should not have any connection whatsoever. However, the experimental evidence suggests the opposite. Although atoms are geographically separated, they are still non-locally connected. And this phenomenon is also known as quantum entanglement. The same entanglement that was suggested by Einstein, who believed that this should not exist. Another very interesting experiment was conducted by the US Army, focusing on the effects of emotions on DNA. They collected the DNA sample from a volunteer's mouth and moved it to another room, where it was monitored for changes. At the same time, the volunteer was shown a series of pictures that were specifically designed to change his emotions in different ways. Some of these pictures were nice, while some were horrifying. What they found was that when the volunteer experienced strong emotional changes, not only a strong cellular discharge was monitored in his body, but also a discharge in the DNA sample in another room. In addition, these responses were precisely measured and no time delay was found, which means that the reaction was instantaneous. To make sure that this was the case, the experiment was repeated over a distance of 350 miles with the same results. The hard mud studies detected a strong bioenergetic field reaching several feet around the body. These studies were cited in hundreds of journals because of the implications that have been demonstrated. Again, a DNA sample was collected from a volunteer and isolated in a glass beaker. Five volunteers were trained in meditation and creating a powerful form of feeling known as coherent emotion. While these five volunteers were focusing on these emotions, the DNA sample was being monitored both chemically and visually. The study found that different emotions had different effects on the DNA, which would either wind or unwind its structure. So what is this energy that is able to cause changes in our DNA over any distance instantaneously? Let's move on, on to the next study, which is about the long-term experiments conducted by Dr. Konstantin Korotko, who demonstrated that sending and receiving of emotions is possible over any distance and with instantaneous effect. We have been in, uh, selecting and inviting people who was really uh, talented uh, Lavrians and talented psyche people. And then we train them how to operate with each other, how to deal with telepathic communications, and we've been measuring all this process. So um, it was 
many sessions like this several years. It was very interesting results, and um, everything we published uh, secret reports on this. Of course, it never been published in uh, any journal, uh, but uh, we have proven that telepathic communication with people is uh, really possible. And it was done on very precise scientific basis. And we are measuring uh, moment of sending emotion. So we are uh, measuring sending and response from biophysical measurements. And this is electroencephalography, electrophotonics, and uh, balancing platform. So we can really detect the moments of sending and receiving. And in all our experiments, it demonstrated that it is no time, sh time shift. Not zero. Zero. Instantaneous yeah, zero. action at a distance. Absolutely. Instantaneous effect. So no time delay, like in the previous experiments. Perhaps many of you have already heard about the famous experiments of Dr. Masaru Imoto, where he exposed water to different types of emotions and music. Then he would freeze this water and photograph water crystals that were formed in different water samples exposed to different emotions or music. The result showed a strong link between these emotions and the formations of water crystals. As you will see in the following video, positive emotions and music create nice and symmetrical structures, whereas negative emotions and music do the opposite. So we can clearly see the effect that emotions and music have on matter and its molecular structure. And what is this invisible force that is capable of modifying the structure of these water crystals? Why does something negative and full of hate shapes the molecular structure into something asymmetrical like this? And why does positive thinking, emotions and music give rise to beautifully organized and highly symmetrical fractal-like structures? And the next study was about the already mentioned influence of intentions on changing water pH value. Qualities of consciousness, intention, emotion, mind or spirit can significantly influence a well-designed target experiment in physical reality. And so in 97, I set out to seriously test that assumption. Uh, having received some uh, important funding from a private source. And so the idea was to design uh, four target experiments, set them up with all the kinds of controls you would have in any normal uh, orthodox science experiment, and to then introduce consciousness into the experimental medium. Uh, the four experiments were to, intention was to increase the pH of water by one full pH unit with no chemical additions um, and the uh, water was in equilibrium with air. The second target experiment was to decrease the pH of the same water by one pH unit with no chemical additions and again in equilibrium with air. And in both cases, the, the accuracy of the measurement instruments were plus or minus 0 0.01 pH units. So we were asking for a signature, which was the order of 100 times the noise. Three weeks, the pH had gone up one pH unit. 